Hey guys, uh, start eight eighty eight point oh seven. Forgot that I was supposed to be filling in for Dylan today. Um, so <laughs> now that it's eleven thirty at night, let's go ahead and do that. Uh, David's question was, what were some cartoons that I watched that had prominent animal characters? And growing up, I guess if like. Um, like humanistic, I can't remember the actual term, anamorphic, I don't remember. Um, if if they count, if they are like, if they're like humans but they're not humans, I'm gonna go with like Rocco's Modern Life, um, Care Bears, watched that a lot as a kid, and the original My Little Ponies, and then the second series My Little Pony Tales, watched those. Um, I remember liking My Little Pony Tales more than the original My Little Ponies. Because if I remember correctly, they're like living everyday life versus like in this like their own world. Like it's it was a little bit different. Um, but yeah, things like that. Let's see. It's it's still May, so we're still on the animal thing. Um, so since. <laughs> And Dylan and I really didn't think this through because I'm gonna be answering my own question. So if I'm answering my own question, uh, show me your zoo, Brit. Yay, zoo. And if Kay actually makes a video tomorrow, then Kay, what would you have in your own personal zoo? If you could have animals in a zoo, like, not like a legitimate zoo, like a zoo like I have. Um, like if you could go to PetSmart and have any of those animals at PetSmart or Petco or wherever you would get an animal from, what would you create in your own little zoo? That's my question for, for Kay, and if not, then I will just show you guys my animals next Tuesday. Awesome. See you guys Tuesday, and hopefully Kay will see you tomorrow.